Hey guys, Troy here with Torchcraft Marine. We've got a special edition here for you guys today. We have a couple freshly finished boats. Uh, I'd like to go over with you guys and show you what we offer and what we can do to these things. If you guys are new to the channel, a uh, little about us. We are located here in Philomath, Oregon, and we specialize in building aluminum micro or mini jet boats as they're commonly referred to. Uh, we just put a lot of extra time into them and we build some really high-end boats uh, that are absolutely certain to turn heads wherever you go and perform extremely well compared to many others on the market. We'll do a walk around here and I'll show you guys uh, our power plants, our jet pumps we use, our controls, electronics, lighting, uh, all the op op options we offer. I want to thank you all in advance for watching. It means a lot to us uh, to be able to show you our product. Give us a minute here and we'll get this camera off the tripod and begin the tour. All right, guys. So what we have here are four Apex models, which are these three. You can always tell the difference. Our top tier level has the four head recessed headlights in it with the Baja designs off-road lights this is our speedster model lightest weight probably the quickest very basic but badass we also have another apex here it's not quite done yet waiting on a few final touches for it but we'll start with the speedster so this guy, along with all the rest of the boats, all have quarter inch bottom, half inch UHMW, full coverage on them, eighth inch sides, eighth inch on everything else, transom, window, etc. All models come with a stomp grate. And what that allows you to do is if you do suck up a bunch of rocks or debris in your intake, shut your engine off, come back here, stomp on that lever, clears all the debris out. All of our boats come with grab rails around the engine bay, on the transom, and up on the bow. This one does have window, wraparound window rails, which is an option. I personally think they're a must on any of these boats. All of our models come with the vinyl wraps, EVA foam decking, made by Ultradeck. Stuff is amazing. Helps quiet the boat down, add style, and it's barefoot friendly. Dogs like it, you can get a lot of gription not sliding around when you're getting crazy. PRP seats from Standard and all of our builds we make an amazing product that is designed for the marine world. We actually have built-in drains down here so you're not getting swamp butt. Every model is fly-by-wire. You have your throttle on the right, braking and reverse on the left, push to start buttons, and our Switch Pro digital controller, all standard. Pulled out here today, geese are headed south. All units will come with navigation lights, bilge blower, bilge pump, 300 horsepower supercharged engine, 20 gallon fuel cell, sound deadening material, catch can, sand trap, cleanable air filter, and all of our fuel systems are EPA compliant and all of our electrical is 100% Coast Guard compliant 
All of our boats do come with flotation foam as well. Every boat you see here today has a brand new 2022 Rotax engine in it with the color display with built-in GPS and Bluetooth controller. On some of the other models, the Navigator and the Apex, they'll actually have Fusion slash Kicker audio systems in them where you can Bluetooth to those as well. Uh, you also find Kicker six and a half inch marine speakers and all the systems we build sound really good. Okay, so that covers the Speedster. Now I'm going to show you guys the Apex. The Apex is by far our best seller. Um, we have built a ton of those and everyone seems to love them. So let me show you what they offer that the other models don't. So the dead giveaway on the Apex is recessed headlights. So four Baja design off-road waterproof lights, 9,600 lumens each. They are ridiculously bright. Keep in mind, these are for off-road use only. When there's other boats around, do not use these. They will be blinded. But good thing about these boats is they go where no other boat can really, unless you got a buddy with an airboat, they might be able to keep up. So the Apex comes with the four recess headlights. The window grab rails. Air ride seat bases. Shows a Fox adjustable shock. You can adjust your suspension, compression, and ride height on them. Uh, this model has heated seats. The plus two width. Also with air lumbar and diamond stitching. The diamond stitch, plus two width, air lumbar, those are additional options that you can add, but there's obviously an upcharge to those. All these boats have the Kicker Marine six and a half inch speakers in the rear. And there's a pair underneath the dash as well. We did add tow hooks to these four boats per request. Uh, another option you get with the Apex is Baja Designs backup lights. These are really nice if you're backing down a dimly lit boat ramp and you can actually see where you're going before you drop the boat in the water. We also have RGB underwater lights. Change a million different colors. Along with all of that, this model also comes with dual batteries, circuit protection and isolation, automatic charge relays, everything to keep your main start battery from going dead, even if you forget to turn the stereo and lights off. Along with exterior lighting, we also have under gunnel LED lights as well. And all of our Apex models have the Garmin 743 with live engine data. So that package gives you a little more data than the standard gauge cluster will. Also chart plotter, sonar capability, uh, very, very nice unit. We also tie into the Fusion head unit, so you can adjust volume or tracks either at the main helm station or the passenger can adjust it there. We also have a Bluetooth remote, removable dongle here that will work at about 50 feet away. So a lot of the common questions we get about these boats. How many inches of water do they need? The answer to that is about three to four inches, but you'd need about 12 inches to get up on plane. That UHMW K1 
Can I slide over rocks and logs? And the answer is yes. Stuff is super slick. And if you don't have this thing secured to your trailer as you back it down the boat ramp, expect to have your boat waiting for you in the water by the time you get back down to the end of the ramp. Very slick stuff. Our fuel systems are specially designed where you can put your nozzle in there, set it at full throttle and walk away and it'll never burp fuel out. Uh, you don't see that on many boats. Very nice feature. Another question we get. Can I tow a tuber or a wakeboarder with one of these? The answer is yes. Will your passenger riding on the tube hate you? Probably. The jet wash on these can be pretty brutal. If you have the pump trimmed all the way up, you better have a really long rope or you can trim it down if you want to save your rider from getting pressure washed in the face by a 300 horsepower pressure washer. Another frequently asked question, can I finance this boat? The answer is yes. We are a registered builder with the Coast Guard and we can help you get financed with one of these fairly easy, assuming you have the credit. Um, we make it a very painless procedure for you. I get asked all the time, how do these do with four grown adults in them? They do excellent. You will need to operate your trim a little more than just riding one up or two up. You have all the power you need to haul four people in these things. Top speeds can range depending on elevation, humidity, etc. But you can expect minimum 55 miles an hour. Had some boats locally, we're only at about 100, right under 150 feet, uh, get up to 64, 65 miles an hour. And my favorite one, what kind of fuel mileage do these get? Well, that all depends. There's three adjustable power levels on the Rotax. It's eco mode, normal mode, and sport mode. With eco mode, the ECU will take a reading, a speed reading, an RPM reading, and it will automatically adjust your speed for you in order to get maximum fuel savings. Well, that comes down to is about 32, 33 miles an hour upriver uh, with a very low gallon per hour burn. Times I use it personally is when I've strayed a little too far away from the boat ramp, I need to nurse her home. Nice feature to have. Typically I'm running in normal and sport mode. Each time the key is cycled, the boat will revert back to normal mode. It's kind of the default setting unless you have some tuning done. Normal mode has really great power, uh, very smooth power delivery. So I've got to pull the throttle lever quite a ways to get up to full speed very drivable best overall fuel burn I'd say in drivability and fairly easy on your fuel tank so you have 20 gallon tanks you drive like a normal human being which most guys that own these don't but <laughs> that's the fun of it you have control of your fuel burn. Now, if you want all the horsepowers, put this thing in sport mode. Sport mode is definitely the most fun, burns the most fuel, but guaranteed to put smiles or the fear of God into anyone in this vessel.
on the subject of fuel these engines do require 91 octane highly recommend running ethanol free clear fuel in them at all times the best performance and at least a bit amount of maintenance definitely don't want to be cleaning injectors and fuel pumps by putting cheap fuel in these things once you put a deposit down for us to build you one of these you'll receive a series of links to pick out your vinyl wrap design your foam decking colors and designs as well as the website to build your custom interior we like to give the customer freedom to uh, build these boats specifically to their needs trailers are optional we do sell boats with or without them these are handcrafted here in Oregon American made these are serious units absolutely badass trailers that are specifically designed for this haul this is not a trailer that was made to fit some other boat and then we just modify it to work this trailer is specifically designed for this haul super lightweight about 350 pounds LED lighting throughout and we'll match your ultra deck your fender wells they do have license plate provision or license plate light provision for you guys that are required to title your trailers all of our boats come with the hen number Coast Guard certification stickers, MSOs for both the boat and the trailer. If you're interested in having us custom build you a boat, give us a call. Our phone number is 541-609-3131. Or you can contact us through our website, www.torchcraftmarine.com. Or you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok, and YouTube. Give us a call. We'd be glad to talk to you about a custom build. Or keep an eye out for our rare inventory models that we get to offer every now and then. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video uh, if you like what you see please give it a like hit the subscribe button if you'd like more of this content please let us know we would love to show you guys our product and how we do it and all that good stuff so there is more content coming once we get a little better weather we can get these things back on the river the rivers are absolutely raging right now so we're uh, gonna let them drop after to get out of flood stage and go have some fun. Thanks for watching.